Commander, fresh news from the war on Iocath. Republic troops capture one of our supply stations. The Empire's leading a retaliation, but we're locked in a stalemate. You always know how to cheer me up. What about our hunt for the traitor in our ranks? We're questioning everyone from the usual suspects to your top advisors. So far, everyone looks clean. We'll find the traitor, but these mole hunts take time. If you had to guess, who do you think betrayed me? Honestly, the longer we search, the more I think someone planted the traitor idea to turn you against your own people. We could be facing an outside threat. Maybe a past rival, someone who wants you dead. Lighten up, Theron. Things aren't all doom and gloom. Well, you look cheery today, Lana. Did Galt spike the calf again? Even better. I found a lead. Alliance agents picked up a signal from the shadow world of Umbara. It's encrypted with the same algorithm the traitor used on Iocath. They're still on the planet, helping our Republic foes grab a massive stockpile of Adegan crystals. Adegan crystals are attuned to the Force. Could our traitor be working with the Jedi or Sith? It's possible, but Darth Malgus once discovered a use for them beyond lightsabers. He's gone, but the Republic may be adapting his work. Both sides have tinkered with the Deegan crystals for years, part of an arms race to build a new arsenal of superweapons. If we move quickly, we can corner the traitor and hijack those crystals. Intel says they're on an Umbar and supply train headed for the capital city. Then we leave now. The traitor won't escape us this time. 